Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel Archituber. I am Architect Vaibhavi and I make content related to architecture and interiors. If you are new here, please take a moment and subscribe to my channel below. So in the previous video, we had the introduction of NATA examination. So in this video, we are going to be discussing about the NATA syllabus. Okay. So the syllabus has changed over the years and the pattern has changed basically. Now you have part A and part B that we are going to be uh, covering soon. Okay. So if you are 12th pass out or if you are an aspiring architecture student, please stay tuned. And uh, I'm going to post every alternate day and we are going to cover most of the NATA syllabus. And in this video, we are going to be discussing about the nata syllabus okay so this year you have part a and part b as i told you so part a has your composition uh, 2d drawings 3d drawings and the perspective drawings okay so you have to prepare yourself for your 2d compositions then 3d compositions you have color theory okay color psychology and then the perspective drawings like uh, one point perspective two point perspective and all of that so uh, prepare yourself we are going to be uh, learning all of that in separate videos okay so let us start with the ppt of syllabus and let's discuss in detail and what topics to study talking about the syllabus as i have mentioned in my previous video we have part a and part b okay so part a has your drawing and part b has aptitude so as of now we are discussing about part a which is drawing which has 2d composition 3d composition and perspective sketching now coming to the part A which has drawing and composition test. Uh, in my previous video, I told you that you have 90 minutes uh, to solve this examination. Okay, and it is of 80 marks. So there will be three questions. So first we'll have composition and colors which will have 25 marks. And uh, this composition and color will have questions related to the various situations uh, suitable compositions and coloring them appropriately or rearranging various shapes in visual appealing manner and coloring it suitably. The second question is sketching and composition which has black and white um, so it has also 25 marks. So in this question number two sketching and composition you have to draw visualize depict a situation involving buildings uh, maybe components people environment products Okay, so you should be understanding the scale, proportion, texture, shade, shadow, etc. Okay, and coming to the 3D compositions, you have to create interesting 3D compositions for the given situation using provided kit. Okay, so now let's see about 2D compositions. As you can see, there are geometric figures and shapes uh, interlocked in the 2D compositions. So in this uh, 2D composition, you will be asked to uh, merge two or three shapes and create uh, a composition maybe then coming to the 3d compositions it's simple basically you have to create basic 3d compositions and 3d shapes okay as per the questions and coming to the perspective drawing you have one point perspective two point perspective as well and the second part uh, which is part b you have your reasoning gk mcqs msq everything so you have to learn visual reasoning, logical reasoning, general knowledge, the famous monuments, the famous architectural buildings in India and as well as the foreign countries, uh, the history of architecture. So I have talked about the history of architecture series. I have a playlist for that. I will link somewhere here on the screen. Okay, and we will try to cover most of the history of architecture which we have from India and from the outside of India. Okay. Now coming on to the part B, uh, part B also has 90 minutes and it has MCQ questions. Okay, the B1 has 30 questions of 2 marks and B2 has 15 questions of 4 marks. The part B consists of visual reasoning, logical derivation, GK architecture and design, language interpretation, design sensitivity, design thinking and numerical ability. Okay, so now discussing about the visual reasoning, you should be able to understand and reconstruct 2D and 3D composition. Okay, so let us discuss about visual reasoning. So you have to understand the top view, front view, side views, uh, side elevations, surface counting, cube counting, series completion, unfolding 3D figures as I mentioned. Okay, the questions will be asked accordingly uh, about the rotations of the figure or the completion of the series. Uh, then talking about the analogies. Okay, then coming to the logical derivation. 
which has your verbal reasoning non verbal reasoning and logical reasoning uh, we will be discussing all of them uh, one by one in the coming videos and talking about the gk and architecture you have famous buildings architectural terms architectural styles color theory famous architects and their works building construction hoa foreign hoa famous architects etc okay so then coming to the numerical ability and language interpretation uh, these all will be the topics for your numerical ability and uh, your language interpretations then uh, coming to the marks and the time limits that uh, they have given for this year so part a has three categories as i told you the composition and color which has 25 marks then the sketching and the composition which has again 25 marks and then you have your 3d composition which has 30 marks in total so uh, the total becomes 80 marks and the time limit is given for 90 minutes for part a okay uh now coming to the part 2 which has your mcqs okay so there are mcqs for 2 marks and 4 marks as i told you you will have architectural uh, questions like the gk uh, the design language interpretations the design sensitivity or the uh, thinking ability they will test okay so for that also we are going to be uh, studying and learning so please stay tuned for that and um, you know the drill please like comment share and subscribe to my channel and in the next video we are going to be discussing about the most important topics of nata 2024 so please stay tuned for that and share with the budding architecture students okay i'll see you in my next video till then take care and bye